is Buzzy here. I just wanted to apologize for the, uh, the long break I took in between uploads. I uh, wanted to take a little bit of a break from YouTube for a little bit, uh, but we're back. And I'm going to be reviewing two customs in this video, like as an apology for not announcing my break. So yeah, might as well get right into it. So for the, uh, the first custom is uh, actually Count the Ways Fun Time Frame. So I based this off of uh, a couple different things, uh, a model of Count the Ways Fun Time Freddy and um, like other customs of Count the Ways Fun Time Freddy. So uh, with this I, uh, I cut off Bon Bon here and I, uh, I sewed a little black circle here and then made some gray and black wires coming off the hand. And then with this I just like glued a wire coming off of the ear. Oh yeah, this is also one of my uh, my only customs that I've used a base for. So for the eyes, I uh, I made new ones that match the uh, the character a little bit better than uh, Fun Time Freddy's old eyes, and I just stuck them on top. And then I uh, I put two wires coming out of his um, eye onto his like muzzle area. I didn't give him teeth because I tried doing that and it looked weird. Uh, his hat I uh, is. A little complicated. I took the original hat, it's here, and then I glued this uh, pink stripe around it, and I cut off the top and put a black uh, sheet of um, fleece on there. Then the top bit is actually this, and I put a black piece of fleece on the bottom of this, and then I just sewed it together with like a pipe cleaner in it, and now it leans open like that. And then on the, uh, the stomach area, I took some trunks out of the bow tie, make it look withered. And then I drew a line down the stomach with a thin sharpie. And then I glued on two little felt buttons and I uh, made a little speaker there too. Um, he's supposed to, I'm pretty sure the speaker is supposed to be like below the buttons. But I mean, uh, the buttons, I didn't want to make the buttons too big because I had to cover Funtime Buddy's original speaker. And I think it just looks better like this. And yeah, I think it looks pretty nice. Uh, I decided to not make it like look dirty because even though like um, the uh, not the way it's fun time Freddy is supposed to be like old and run down, I wanted this plush to look like uh, like um, like it was newish, you know? Because I just like if you add too many details on plush, it starts to look um, like strange. I like I learned my lesson with that because I my original Molten Freddy custom. It, I put a bunch of like dirt and stuff on it using sharpies and it just didn't look too good. But uh, anyway, this is Count the Ways Fun Time Freddy. Alright, now I'm going to be moving on to the next custom, which is actually a uh, Plants vs. Zombies custom. Uh, Snow Pea. Now, this one I made my own pattern for. I basically just uh, made the head using a couple different, four little pieces. And then I glued or not glued, I sewed these on, on the back for like the crystals in the back. And then I put just a black circle glued onto the mouth, glued on the eyes. Then I made like a green cylinder here for the stem. And for these shapes, well technically eight, because each of these is two pieces. And then I sewed them together. And then I stuck the, uh, the stem down in between them. And there we go, it's a simple flush, but it's a nice one. Uh, yeah, I mean, it looks decent. Uh, I definitely could have improved it some, and I probably will in the future, but I really like this plush. So, yeah, Snow Pea. So those are the, the two customs I have for this video. I'm going to be uploading like a proper plush video very soon. Uh, still working on that though. But uh, yeah, uh, Snow Pea, fun, Count the Ways, Fun Time Freddy. I think they look nice. Uh, if you like the video, like it, maybe subscribe, hit the bell. Uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Bye.